Hi, welcome to this introductory tutorial on opening your web editor of Copernicus Data Space Ecosystem. In this video, we will delve into open your web editor, which is a web-based graphical user interface. It will allow you to interact with open your API and perform various tasks related to Earth observation data processing. Together, we will explore on how to access this web portal and also learn about its basic features. So let's get started. On the main website, when you hover over Analyze Data, you will notice Open Your Editor from the drop down menu. This will lead you to Open Your Web Editor. Or you can simply add Open You to the main URL, resulting in openio.dataspace.copernicus.eu. When you click on this link, you land into the Open Your Web Editor portal. It is important to ensure that you are logged in. While you can still explore and observe all the feature and functionality even if you are logged out, please note that downloading data or executing process will require you to be logged in. Therefore, for full access to all the capabilities, make sure you are logged into the platform. You can log in with Copernicus Data Space Ecosystem credentials. Now once logged in, we can explore both features as well as the process. But in this example, we will only focus on the features. Starting with the sidebar that offers the ability to navigate through available collections, processes, user-defined runtimes and export file formats. At the top, you will also notice a search bar where you can search any process or features a collection available within the Open Your Web Editor portal. Within collection sections, user can access comprehensive list of data collection available in the backend through Open Your. Under the processes section, user can find a comprehensive list of Open Your processes. The user defined runtime section provide information on available environments of platform where user-defined functions can be executed. Similarly, Export File Format section will guide you through the supported output formats within OpenEU. Moving to the nav bar, we have Help. The Help icon at the top of the screen will provide a short tour of the main section to the editor. The wizard is an experimental feature that will help you to create open your process in a simple way for some common use. You can find a detailed explanation on using this feature in Open Your Wizard video tutorial. The server icon will pop up a window giving the user detailed information on the server used for processing the created processes. Then we have Process Editor, where user can drag and drop the collection processes and accordingly execute the process that was created. For example, this is a simple process of creating burnt area index. In the bottom of the Process Editor, you can see two tabs, Visual Mode and Code. Visual Mode is where you can create process chain by simply dragging the collection and process connecting them with each other whereas in the code mode it allows you to see the generated process which is usually only needed if you want to run the process using another client library. At the top of this process editor you can see several functionality that can come into handy when executing the process such as clearing the current script, importing additional scripts or exporting them. To the bottom of the web editor, you can see a list of process that was executed. There is option to visualize their details. As well as to check the log of the process that was executed. This was all about opening your web editor and its basic features. For further information on creating process and executing them, 
we encourage you to check our additional video tutorials. It will guide you through the detailed steps and ensure a comprehensive understanding. If you have any queries or questions along the way, we kindly request you to submit them as a ticket in the Copernicus Data Space Ecosystem Help Center. Our dedicated support team will be happy to help you. Thank you for listening.